assuming she lets you know these four things, leave her quickly to your benefit. Her connections, by their actual nature, can perplexing and request. While exploring through the bunch of feelings and encounters that accompany being in an organization, staying careful about specific warnings is essential. These admonition signs can act as essential marks of more profound issues that might think twice about mental and close-to-home well-being. In this blog entry, we will dive into six explicit articulations that, whenever communicated by your accomplice, ought to urge you to rethink the relationship for your own prosperity genuinely. Understanding these warnings is fundamental to protecting your satisfaction and guaranteeing a sound, steady organization. 1. I have zero faith in you. Trust is the bedrock whereupon any sound relationship is fabricated. At the point when your accomplice unequivocally states, I have little to no faith in you, it connotes a significant issue that can't be neglected. Trust issues can appear in various ways, including consistent addressing, attacking individual space, or even crooked allegations. Such ways of behaving can prompt a harmful climate, at last influencing your psychological wellness. The shortfall of trust can have extensive ramifications. It frequently breeds frailty, nervousness, and profound pressure. The absence of trust in each other can make a pattern of doubt and uncertainty, making it hard to support a cherishing and strong relationship. On the off chance that you end up in a circumstance where your accomplice confesses to not believing you, it is basic to promptly resolve this issue. Neglecting to do so can bring about a heightening of pessimistic feelings and ways of behaving, further harming the relationship. Besides, trust issues can ruin viable correspondence, a foundation of any effective relationship. At the point when trust is compromised, transparent discourse become intriguing, prompting mistaken assumptions and unsettled clashes. This breakdown in correspondence can worsen the sensation of detach, making it trying to settle on something worth agreeing on and figure out through issues together. It's fundamental to comprehend that reconstructing trust is a complex and tedious interaction requiring responsibility from the two players. In any case, assuming that your accomplice is reluctant to do whatever it takes to reestablish trust, rethinking the relationship might be shrewd. Going on seeing someone of trust can be genuinely depleting and negative to your prosperity. All in all, trust is non-debatable in any relationship. On the off chance that your accomplice transparently confesses to not believing you, a warning requirements prompt consideration. Tending to believe issues from the get-go can either prepare for modifying a more grounded bond or feature the need to continue on to your benefit. Self-awareness is a fundamental part of any relationship, cultivating shared regard and understanding. Nonetheless, when that's what an accomplice demands you really want to change to be okay, it flags a possible warning. While helpful analysis pointed toward advancing positive way of behaving or propensities is valuable, manipulative requests for change can disintegrate confidence in individual personality. Eventually, a relationship ought to be a safe haven where the two people can flourish, not a landmark for strength and control. Assuming that you wind up continually constrained to change to fulfill your accomplice's guidelines, it could be an ideal opportunity to reconsider the relationship. Focusing on your confidence and personality is imperative for your general prosperity and future joy. It's essential to truly perceive these indications of psychological mistreatment and take them. Continually hearing that you are not sufficient can have long-haul suggestions for your psychological wellness and generally prosperity. In the event that you end up in a circumstance where your accomplice habitually causes you to feel deficient, it very well might be an ideal opportunity to reevaluate the relationship. Understanding the mental effect of such destructive proclamations is the most important move towards safeguarding your profound well-being and recovering your healthy identity worth. 2. You're overcompensating. At the point when somebody lets you know that you are blowing up, it very well may be an unpretentious type of gaslighting. Gaslighting is a manipulative way of behaving where one individual endeavors to make another uncertainty their own discernments, sentiments, and mental stability. This strategy can be profoundly harming in connections, as it subverts one's self-assurance and close-to-home prosperity. Understanding gaslighting and figuring out how to answer are key stages in safeguarding your close-to-home well-being. Nobody ought to need to get through a manipulative way of behaving that refutes their sentiments. Perceiving these signs early can assist you with arriving at informed conclusions about your relationship and guarantee your prosperity. 3. I don't need you spending time with your companions. Seclusion from loved ones, 
is a typical strategy utilized by controlling accomplices. At the point when an accomplice deters, or by and large denies you from investing energy with your companions, it is much of the time a warning showing endeavors to control your public activity. Keeping up with social associations is significant for your general prosperity, as these connections offer profound help, elective points of view, and a feeling of having a place. Perceiving these signs early is fundamental for keeping a reasonable and solid relationship. It is imperative to state your entitlement to mingle and look for help from the individuals who really have your well-being on the most fundamental level. An accomplice who really regards and loves you will comprehend the significance of your social associations and will urge you to support them. On the off chance that you end up in a circumstance where your public activity is being limited, it could be an ideal opportunity to re-examine the relationship for your own prosperity. 4. On the off chance that you leave me, I'll hurt myself. Dangers of self-hurt in a relationship are a serious and manipulative strategy. At the point when an accomplice says, in the event that you leave me, I'll hurt myself, it makes a troubling and profound tie intended to keep you in the relationship. Such proclamations have significant close to home and mental effects, frequently leaving the other individual inclination caught and committed to remain, not out of affection or responsibility, but rather out of dread and culpability. The close to home weight of these dangers can overpower. You could feel answerable for your accomplice's prosperity, prompting elevated tension and even misery. This control can disintegrate your identity worth and independence, making it hard to plainly see the relationship. It's vital to perceive that dangers of self-hurt are a type of psychological mistreatment. They are a coercive strategy used to control and rule, as opposed to cultivating a sound, shared relationship. At last, your prosperity and security are fundamental. Perceiving these poisonous examples and doing whatever it takes to address them is urgent for your psychological and close-to-home well-being. Keep in mind you are not liable for another person's activities and remaining in a relationship out of dread or culpability is never a sound choice. Forth, In the event that she shows an absence of sympathy or excuses your sentiments, it demonstrates an absence of basic encouragement and shared regard. Fifth, watch for indications of desire or possessiveness, which can grow into poisonous and hurtful ways of behaving. Finally, perceive on the off chance that she disengages you from loved ones, as this is a strategy frequently used to apply control and predominance. Your psychological and profound well-being ought to constantly be fundamentally important. On the off chance that you end up seeing someone these warnings are available, it is vital for find proactive ways to safeguard yourself. Looking for help from confided in companions, relatives, or expert instructors can give the direction and strength expected to leave a harmful relationship. For those battling to pursue the choice to leave, various assets are accessible. Hotlines, support gatherings, and online discussions offer help and guidance for people in troublesome connections. Keep in mind, focusing on your prosperity is certainly not an indication of shortcoming, however, a demonstration of your solidarity and self-esteem. Leaving a harmful relationship is rarely simple, however, perceiving these admonition signs and venturing out towards a better, more joyful future. Continuously recollect that you should be seeing someone you feel esteemed, regarded, and adored.